All right, thank you, Max. Longhorns fans certainly did some good old-fashioned celebrating and some friendly trash talking after their big win against OU this afternoon. Fox 4's Neha Curtis was out at the Cotton Bowl and found out why this victory was so sweet for UT. You knew the game was over as the sea of red left the Cotton Bowl with minutes still left in the fourth quarter. And that kind of victory was just what Longhorns were looking for. First time in I don't know how many years, we've been together for about six years. Every single time I hear nothing but, it's my turn. This has been one of the most satisfying Longhorn wins in a long time. Well, it was our turn. As the game got into the final minutes, OU fans knew their fate but didn't want to see it up on the board. At what point in the game did you kind of think, oh man, this is over? At four minutes in the fourth quarter. Still about three minutes to go. <laughs> then we gave up. I left about five minutes left in the game. Okay, so you kind of you didn't want to see the end. No. No, I knew it was over. Many OU fans were surprised by the outcome because the Sooners were considered two touchdown favorites. So I honestly thought we were going to kill them. I honestly thought we were going to take this one. We got our butt kicked. But they accepted the loss and the Longhorns' its bragging rights. How are you dealing with the uh, Longhorn fans right now? Uh, we're just uh, kind of hanging out, <laughs> biding our time. They have a reason to celebrate. It was a good game. We did it to them. They are doing it to us. The rivalry, however competitive, had to stay civil, especially when the house is divided. It was a good game. We lost. What can I say? You know, Texas came. They came over. You know, they did it. So, you got to, you know, deal with the loss. But part of your family seems like they're going to be celebrating. Oh, yeah. yeah. Are you going to keep taunting him? <laughs> At least for a good month or so. I have to. Oh, you sucks. Oh, you still sucks. No. It's all about Texas, baby. Hey. Neha Curtis, Fox 4 News.